and talk about our looming wildfire season in May, of course, being Wildfire Preparedness Month. And dozens of homeowners in Placer County coming out today to learn what more that they can do specifically with their homes that are moving fast during these wildfires. Fox 40's Rowena Shaddix caught up with residents and some firefighters in Forest Hill today to find out more about what's going on up there. trying to find a balance between living in beautiful Forest Hill, but making it safe. So we want the beauty and the nature, but in a safe way. On Wildfire Preparedness Day, about 150 Placer County residents, including Julie Davis, we're talking about really cutting back trees and making it more residential and safer, gathered information from the Forest Hill Fire Protection District and the Forest Hill Fire Safe Council on how to keep their homes safe and fire resilient. That embers are a lot of start of a lot of the fires in these wildfires. Unfortunately, Unfortunately, people lose homes, and so there's things they can do to harden their homes. And then, of course, make sure that the space around their home is defensible so that if something does come through, that the fire the fighters have a chance to defend their homes. Well, the bridge fire of last year burned more than 400 acres. It's something that people in Placer County don't want to see happen again. With the devastating wildland fires of last year, which destroyed thousands of homes, fire officials are hoping homeowners stay on top of their properties to ensure wild brush is whacked down and cleared. A lot of the homeowners have already done a lot of work. Uh, talk to others that are just getting started. So, you know, any, any information that we can get them that, that helps them provide that defensible space is, is really the goal. The deputy chief says Placer County is ranked number two in the nation for having certified firewise communities, a title they will work hard to keep. In Forest Hill, Rowena Shaddix, Fox 40 News.